Minos was sovereignly reigning over the island of Crete, a descendant of a rather distinguished lineage. He was the son of the Princess Europa with Zeus, the Lord of Olympus. The god turned himself into a white bull and succeeded in kidnapping the maiden and taking her to the island of Crete. The couple had three sons, Minos, Radamanthus, and Sarpedon, who would inherit the island of Crete. Minos succeeded in overruling his brothers and took the crown of the island of Crete for himself alone. The island was situated on a strategic route in the Mediterranean, which yielded great profits for the kingdom from trade with various nations. King Minos used his vast accumulated wealth to build the great palace of Knossos. To build his splendid palace, he got help from a brilliant Athenian architect and inventor known as Daedalus, Notwithstanding his kingdom's tremendous development during his reign, Minos was still a disputed king. To solidify his power, Minos asked the gods for help. The king requested the god Poseidon to send him a bull for sacrifice in honor of the god of the seas, to show that the gods were on his side. Poseidon granted the king's request and raised from the sea a magnificent white bull as beautiful as the one Zeus had transformed himself into to abduct Europa. Minos was astonished by the animal's size and decided to stop it from being sacrificed by adding it to his herd as a breeding bull, thus establishing a breed of superior cattle. The king chose to sacrifice an ordinary bull from his herd instead of the one that Poseidon offered him. This angered the god of the seas, who had granted that animal to be sacrificed for his own glory. Poseidon could not allow such disregard for the gods to go unpunished. The god made the bull he had gifted become an angry and indomitable animal. It caused damage to the kingdom of Minos and frightened the population. But his revenge was not yet complete. With Aphrodite's help, Poseidon arranged for Pasiphae, queen and wife of Minos, to fall in love with the bull. The queen tried to draw closer to the beautiful bull, who rejected Pasiphae's approach. Enraptured by her passion for the animal, she asked Daedalus to help her seduce the great bull. The ingenious inventor came up with an unusual idea. He created a replica of a cow made of leather and wood, with a chamber where Pasiphae would be housed. This way, the queen managed to achieve her union with the Minos bull. The Minotaur, a creature half man and half bull, was born from this loathsome union. The birth of the hideous beast caused great shame to King Minos. As the Minotaur grew, his bestial and violent nature was no longer manageable. Minos ordered Daedalus to erect a huge labyrinth where the fearsome Minotaur would be imprisoned. This labyrinth became the dwelling place of one of the most heinous creatures of Greek mythology that was fed with human sacrifices. But the terror sparked by the Minos monster would find its demise when confronted by a tremendous opponent named Theseus.